It's absolutely my privilege to have this opportunity to pay tribute to our donors. Over the past few years, I've often walked along this waterfront and I've seen it go from green space to an impressive excavation with a massive mound of dirt, to the skeleton of a building, to the beautiful facility that we're in today. Each time I've walked by, I've felt a sense of gratitude and pride. Our community's generosity is reflected in every brick, in every wall, and in every stunning vista we can see through the windows. 10 years ago, our community was faced with what seemed to be an insurmountable challenge. We had to find $70 million in community donations to fund a long list of new spaces at all three of our hospitals so that we'd continue to enjoy access to extraordinary specialized care close to home. And over the years, we've attended many ribbon cuttings celebrating the successful achievement of that $70 million goal. But this building, our new Providence Care Hospital, for me, is the brightest light in that 10-year journey. It's not surprising to me that our citizens supported an intensive care unit and a, chem a chemo suite and a cardiac clinic and many other acute care spaces. These are all spaces that we can imagine we might need someday. But in choosing to support this project, our community has helped to ensure that some of the most vulnerable, less visible, often weary, ill, and injured people in our community will also have access to the best care in the very, very best care environment. So thank you to every one of the more than 40,000 households in our region who voluntarily gave to all of these projects. Thank you to the City of Kingston, the County of Frontenac, and the many other municipalities who supported our vision. And thank you in particular to the individuals, community organizations, and businesses who chose to direct their gifts to this hospital. I hope that all of you in the room today and all who supported this project join in the pride that I feel right now as I look at all that we have accomplished together. Thank you, Denise. So speaking on behalf of the patients and clients and family members, I want to also thank you to all the donors and supporters of the Hospital Foundation. So thanks. So now please welcome Kathy Dunn, former Providence Care CEO and current board member of the Catholic Health Sponsor of Ontario to the front. 